Yes, what's good everybody? So quick ship vid. Uh Leeds are playing Real Betis literally as we speak. It's 3 2 8 7 minutes in, but I've got a crack on so I want to go get pissed. So I've signed out. Pascal's just come off. Greenwood's come on. Um mint to see um Firpo and Bamford linking up. Brilliant cross, awesome finish. So Bamford straight back on goals, in straight into the goals. Uh, Rodrigo started obviously in behind. Uh, it's getting exciting now, isn't it? So, um, yeah, somebody mentioned that me rocking on the chair. You, you just have to get over it. Yeah, man. No, I'm only messing. I don't know why I rock, but I enjoy the rock. I don't like to sit still. But, yeah, the quick ship vid. Uh, I forgot to mention in the last game uh, that Cock had the armband on didn't it which I know we didn't have like a full squad out but there were some more senior players there that I'd have potentially thought I'd have had it I found that quite interesting so he's obviously a bit of an I know it's only pre-season but he's obviously a bit of an influence in and around the club which is ace isn't it or mint um, Lorente has come off in this game against Real Betis after 24 minutes with something wrong with his knee or his ankle which having just said in the last video we sort of got got back on board and um He's no longer the sick note. It does panic me. It panics me every time, to be honest. He goes into a fucking tackle. So, But also, I can confirm that Christopher Saklarsson has signed, which is wicked, the 20-year-old Norwegian keeper. Um, but, I mean, in his interview, he's sort of aware that he's the second fiddle to Meslier, Silent S. And when I say fiddle, I don't mean I'll dodge you about that. It's not, I don't think he's playing Meslier, Silent S's fiddle uh, or his devil's clarinet. But he's, he's obviously aware that he's, he's second in line, uh, but hopes to sort of push him on and maybe get a couple of starts and stuff. So it's good to have someone there, isn't it? Obviously, Cassie has moved on. Um, Triore has popped back up, with, so that keeps coming around doing the, doing the, doing the rounds, doesn't it? £30 million are talking for him. He divides opinion on this channel a bit. I still think he'd be a decent signing. His end product's a bit shit, but uh, I think Bielsa can... Not sort that, but I think with the type of drills that we do, I'm, uh, well, I assume it's apparently this it, repetition in it with Bielsa, so he, you know he knows where he wants his players, and it's all close to the byline type of stuff in it with the wingers, so it's more mainly just like, I mean, Harrison's really wide player, but you know it's it's byline sort of stuff in it, so it's cutbacks and like Alioski did it a lot, didn't he? Um, Rafinha does it a lot where he gets into the box and it's a cutback rather than like. You know, an actual delivery. Uh, ben White signed officially for Arsenal for over 50 million, which I think is pretty strong. There were a few people giving, like, a, they're doing that um, comparison between him and Varane that's obviously signed for Scum. But I don't, one, I don't think that's a fair fair example. They're on about how much he's won and stuff. And obviously, Varane is the finished article, but he's also the finished article, isn't he? So he's finished, or he's coming towards finishing. So I don't really see the comparison. I think Ben White's overpriced at 50 million. I've been no, res no disrespect to him. I love him, but um, he's never achieved anything other than helping us come up. Which I still love Ben White. I'm not. That's not. A, it's not a diss. But they're obviously thinking future. And really, who else wants to sign for Arsenal at the moment? Like in terms of well, like Varane, for instance. He's not. He's not going to Arsenal, is he? Um, so I think it's time, just like my ex Bird, to officially unfollow him. I've got to unfollow Ben White on Instagram because there's only so long I can go. I held out, and then when he were at Brighton, it got on my tits a bit. Um, if I'm honest, I can't help myself. So I think it's time to unfollow him. Um, but I'll leave you lot to decide that. If I could do a poll, I would, but I can't, so I won't. But, yeah, just let us know, is it worth the unfollow or not? Um, be interested to see. And then there's because we've missed out on that Conor Gallagher... Um, he's he's definitely off on loan. Uh, fucking, my tummy's rumbling. I'm starving. We're, we're on about this midfielder from Huddersfield who I don't know who he is. 22 years old. Uh, Lewis O'Brien is called. Played 42 matches in Championship last year, but he'd obviously, um, you know, plays a lot of games. Obviously, a decent backup because we don't really need. I don't think we need anybody. We just need a bit more strength in depth there. Don't we? We've got Dallas Click. Obviously, Phillips sits, but Phillips could push on a little bit more. Rodrigo can play in behind. Um, yeah, 
So I think we've got plenty of options in there. And by the looks of it, it would, you know, he's, he's still looking at Rafinha in behind, but it's hard to tell with friendlies. But I'm waffling. But yeah, that's my quick shit vid. If you follow me on Instagram, uh, drop us a message and I'll follow you back. And I've got a membership channel, which is 99p a month. And I just want to give a quick shout out to Mark Sharp for signing up. I appreciate you, dude. I appreciate everybody, but particularly my members. So yeah, nice one. I'm one, one member off my life being changed, I think. So that's obviously a joke. It's only 99p, but it goes a long way. It buys me, well, it didn't even buy me 99p ice cream because they're not 99 and anyway, definitely going on a tangent here but yeah uh, sadly no need for dictionary corner really because I think I've got Christopher Saclarsen down since I think I've got that on lock so and Ben White's pretty easy Traore Bamford Furpo easy stuff Mark Sharp nice solid name easy Lewis o although Lewis O'Brien Lewis O'Brien maybe I fucked that one up right I'm going to go because I'm definitely babbling so I take it easy um, hopefully we get a last minute equaliser but I don't think that's happening um, nice one, I'll see you all I might not pop in tomorrow but I'll be in on Monday it'll be more regular now I might pop in tomorrow, fuck it nice one